Hi, I'm Oldham County Sheriff Steve Sparrow, and I'd like to bring a couple things to your attention during this monthly bulletin. One of them is our Ironman, which is going to be taking place on October the 9th, and it's going to be throughout Oldham County, usually mostly on Highway 42. So I want to remind the folks out here that uh, be careful the fact that you're on your cell phone talking and texting. It doesn't take but a second while you're texting to run off the road and you know we're going to have about 2,500 bicycles coming through Oldham County this year. So please be mindful of the pedestrians and the bicyclists during the Oldham County Ironman. The other thing I'd like to bring to your attention is the, <clears throat> excuse me, our national drug take back. We're going to have that October the 22nd and that's going to be between the hours of 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. and you've got one of two locations that you can take your drugs to. The first location will be at the LaGrange Fire Station 2 at 3637 West Highway 146 in Buckner. And the other one is at the Oldham County Police Department and that address is 1855 North Highway 393 and it's at the Oldham County Police Department. And they're both, both locations are in Buckner. This is Frank Conway, Chief of the LaGrange Police Department. I'd like to remind everybody that September 17th at 9 a.m. at on 2nd Street between Jefferson and Maine in LaGrange, we will be having a first annual bike rodeo. Uh, we're going to gear the event towards kindergarten through fifth graders, bring your children out, their bike, and any safety equipment, elbow pads, knee pads, helmets that they have, and we will have an obstacle course set up where they can ride through cones, learn about safety, talk with officers, and the first 40 kids will receive a free bike helmet donated by the LaGrange Walmart. Uh, the event starts at 9 a.m. and will be over hopefully around noon. If you'd like to register your children in advance, you can go to our website at lagrangepolice.com or our Facebook page, which is LaGrange Police Kentucky, and you can print out a registration form there. Or you can call the LaGrange Police Department at 502-225-0444 or stop by 121 West Main Street in LaGrange and pick up a copy of the registration form. You can also register that morning, uh, but to speed the process up, it'd be better if you uh, did it in advance. I'd also like to talk a little bit about the, the amount of car break-ins that are going on in LaGrange. Uh, they're really not car break-ins, they're people leaving their vehicles unlocked and their valuables on the front seat. The LaGrange Police Department is adopted, adopting a Stow It, Don't Show It campaign where we're asking residents to take their valuables off their front seats out of their floorboards and stow them away either in their trunks or take them inside their residence. We'd also like to ask them to lock their vehicle. An unlocked vehicle is an invitation for someone to go through your vehicle and take any valuables you may have inside. Once again, if you'd like to contact the LaGrange Police Department, do it at 502-225-0444. Our tip line is 502-8738945. And I'd like to remind you once again of September 17th is our upcoming bike rodeo. Hi, I'm Greg Smith, Chief of Home County Police Department. I want to remind everybody that October the 9th is the Ironman competition again. And again, a good portion of the bike ride will come through Oldham County. You know, we anticipate that the bikes will first come through Oldham County about 8.30 in the morning. And if all goes well and without any difficulties, they should be out of here by 5.30 or 6 p.m. Now we've been told there's about 3,000 participants, large number. We know that's gonna cause some problems, but if people are patient and cooperative, I think things will work real well. Expect delays, uh, and again, please be, please be uh, patient with us. There are some route changes. We will post those route changes on our website. It will be oldencountypolice.com. Um, and as I say, please pay attention. And please pay attention to the officers in the intersections. They will give you the directions. They will help you get through the intersection. So a little cooperation, a little patience. And I think it all worked well for all of us. Thank you. One other issue I'd like to bring up to you before we close is the addresses on mailboxes. We have a lot of people who are moving into Oldham County, and a lot of them don't put their addresses on their mailbox. And in Oldham County, we do have an ordinance for that. But Mainly it's for your safety. Should you have to call the Oldham County Central Dispatch for an emergency, it really does help the law enforcement and the fire and EMS to find your locations immediately. So we would like to get everybody to get those 
addresses on their mailbox, especially in a three inch format so it's easily seen for the officers or the emergency responders. But right now, that's all I have. Thank you very much.